hello students today we are going to start our first class on the course book the poem today we are going to read is the rainbow by christina rossetti so have you seen a rainbow what is a rainbow we can see a rainbow in the sky what is it it is a multicolored arc in the sky which appears when sunlight hits water droplets it sounds quite difficult i am making it easy when we look up in the sky after it rains you can see a colorful lines cut lines in the sky what is it it is rainbow you can see seven colors in the rainbow if you look at the board you can see i have drawn a picture of seven colors what are the colors there i have written v i b g y o r these are the first letter of the colors v stands for violet i stands for indigo b for blue g for green y for yellow o for orange and r for red so these seven colors make up the rainbow and it looks very beautiful in the sky and you must remember that it is not in a straight line it is always formed in a curved line like a arc so in this poem the poet is christiana rossetti what she is trying to say she is just trying to here admire the beauty of the flying clouds and the natural beauty that we can see let me read the poem the rainbow boats sail on the rivers and ships sail on the seas but clouds that sail across the sky are prettier than this so what we can understand from here the poet is is trying to say that we can see that boats travel on the rivers and we can see ships traveling on the seas but when we look up in the sky the clouds that fly in the sky or that travel in the sky that looks far more better than the boats and the ships that sail in the sky let me again make it quite clear that what poet is wanting to say thus in the poem the poet is is wanting to say that boats that sail on the river or that travel on the river and the sea on which the ships sail they look beautiful but the clouds that travel on the sky are far more beautiful than those ships and the boats that sail on the rivers and the seas so in these four lines you can understand that the poet is is trying to say that the natural beauty is far more beautiful so today we will learn only these four lines and the rest of the poem i will teach you in the next class but your homework will be to learn these four lines of the 